In today's video, we're going to take you through how we prototype, test, and validate new automotive panel plug designs here at Echo Engineering. We start here by first rapid prototyping the mold for the plugs. Depending on the size and number of cavities, this portion takes us typically only a few hours. After the mold is completed, we heat it up and add the rubber material to the cavities. We are now able to do either silicone or EPDM for this step. Once the material is added, the plugs are molded for several minutes until they're fully cured. After the plugs are hand trimmed and inspected, we move on to performing insertion force testing using custom developed jigs that are designed and developed in-house. All plugs that we make are designed to be installed using a tool to help with ease of installation. We typically suggest to a customer that they use a T-handled nut driver or similar tool during installation. We have worked with many customers with this line of plug. Typical installation speed is 50 millimeters per minute. This is an ideal speed to allow us to observe how the plug deforms and performs during installation. It also allows our universal test machine to gather a dense amount of data to ensure that we capture an accurate maximum compression force reading. After that, we are able to move on to water column testing. Water column testing can be tuned to a customer's requirements very easily. But in general, we follow some typical guidelines to ensure that plugs don't leak. If the plug is intended to be used on a range of different panel thicknesses, we will test at both ends of the extreme tolerances. All of our panels are made of water jet cut aluminum because that is what most body panels are typically made of. This gives us a good control on the hole tolerance and a clean cut that replicates a punched hole very well. All of our plugs are tested at various water column heights to meet customer needs. Some customers want to check full submersion of their vehicles and want to check at a full 2 meters deep. Others may have another scenario like wading through water during a storm and only require 15 centimeters deep. Alright, so there you have it. This has been a brief overview of what it takes to prototype and test automotive panel plugs before kicking off production tooling. New technology has allowed us to wipe months off this project, which is a huge deal with how fast new electric vehicle designs are changing in today's world. We'll leave a link in the description for more information on this. Be sure to like and subscribe for future content. And with that said, we'll see you all next time.